on the morning of Friday, April the 26th, at approximately 2.47 a.m., the Coppers Cove Fire Department was dispatched to 2210 East Highway 190 in Coppers Cove for a motor vehicle collision with a building uh, with fire and possibly a person trapped inside of the vehicle. Uh, fire department units arrived on scene did indeed find the vehicle burning as well as the front of the building in one of the units. After the flames were extinguished down, uh, an inspection of the vehicle did take place and a person was found inside of the vehicle and it was determined at the time when they did the inspection that the individual was in fact uh, deceased and was unable to receive any life-saving measures. Uh, police notice us, you know, it's got on fire and we came here and the, uh, I mean, kind of building uh, across the 190 uh, insurance company, some cars stuck inside and, the, you know, it's on fire. And the... um, it looks, uh, we haven't been able to look inside, but two windows are melted out and it looks like around the front door there's like a lot of smoke damage. They had to put the fire out so there might be water or some smoke damage. So I rushed down here because I was worried. And when I got here, I had heard that a car somehow hit over here, went airborne, flipped once, landed <laughs> on the porch in front of this insurance place on its side with the driver's side up and caught on fire. We don't have any details at this particular point in time. That uh, entire investigation concerning the, the incident uh, has been turned over to the Coppers Cove Police Department. Uh, the Coppers Cove Fire Marshal is also working hand in hand with them to make a final determination on uh, how the incident actually occurred, what took place, what caused the fire, and so forth. They're working together hand in hand to handle that.